Hey guys, welcome back to my channel, Nick here, and today I've got something pretty interesting that I think you're gonna like. I'm gonna be showing you the meal that I cook on pretty much all of my overnight backpacking trips, and that is my loaded mashed potatoes. It's great because it uses the one pot cooking method, which makes the cleanup super quick and simple. And when you're out on the trail, it's obviously something that you want. It's kind of unique because you can swap out the ingredients for pretty much whatever you want to suit your taste exactly how you need. For mine, I used instant mashed potatoes, asparagus, bacon bits, and dried onions. All of these ingredients can be easily found at your local grocery store for pretty cheap. You don't just have to use this on overnight backpacking trips, I use it also on just hiking day trips, camping with the family and buddies, and I also use it just at home because it really is that quick and simple. So without further ado, I'm going to bring you guys out on the trail and I'm going to be making it for you guys. Alright, so we're out on the trail now and I've got myself a nice little place to cook. This should only take about 10 to 15 minutes, but when it's done, it's gonna be awesome. So, it's really not an exact science. It's super easy, you can really do it however you want. Today I'm using a jet boil, but you can really use any kind of backpacking stove and pot that you have. The jet boil works because it just boils water really fast, and for this recipe, that's really all we're gonna be doing. So, I'm gonna get right into it and show you how to do it. All right, so like I said, it's really not an exact science, but the first step here is I'm gonna be adding a little bit of water to this pot. I'm gonna be filling it probably about, eh, I'll say about halfway with this water. All right, about that much should do. So now the next step is gonna be, I'm just gonna turn the pot on and I'm gonna let this get to a rolling boil. All right, so I brought that up to a boil and I turned my stove off now. So the first step I'm gonna do is add my instant mashed potatoes. And I'm gonna add just enough, a little bit more water than you would want for your final product. All right, so I'm gonna just stir that up. All right. All right, so if there's any wind noise, I really apologize, it's my bad. But uh, so the next step after that, once you get your potatoes a little bit more watery than you would want, you're gonna add your asparagus or really whatever, like I said before, you can substitute for whatever ingredients or vegetables you want. I'm gonna add that. And the next step is gonna be, I'm gonna add the bacon bits and the onion. All right, so I've added the bacon bits and the onion, and I'm gonna let it sit with the cap on for about five to 10 minutes, just so that it can absorb all the water into the, the dry ingredients, and I'm gonna let the asparagus steam for a little bit. All right, gotta put this in a little Tupperware bowl. Sorry again if there's wind noise, it's my bad. Oh yeah, it's looking good. And trust me, it might not look like a lot, but this is really gonna be filling, I promise. So uh, this is what we got. It doesn't really look like a lot, but this is super filling. And it's gonna give you all the energy and nutrients you need to keep good on the trail. So we're gonna give it a little taste. Mm, it's still really hot. I swear, if you make this at home, nobody will be able to tell. This is super good. It tastes just like homemade mashed potatoes. All right, so if you like this video, go ahead and give it a thumbs up and subscribe. And I'd really appreciate it if you gave me some feedback. This is the second video I'm putting out on my channel. And it's really cool. I use this method a lot. I use this recipe a lot. And I thought I'd just share it with you guys. So have a good one.